The story behind this body of work is my life and my coming out to the world, coming out as trans, my story growing up and hiding who I was for so long and feeling unheard and finally I'm putting all that quietness and those secrets I kept, I'm putting it all out there and expressing it. I'm Victor and I'm an artist. I work digitally and I use my iPad and Procreate. And when I work physically, I use canvas and acrylic paint, sometimes oil paint. My art is super colorful and vibrant. And from far away, it looks like a really happy children's book. When you look back again, you kind of realize that the posture of the characters, it wasn't happy and it's all like a facade. One thing that's hard about this, I know I could kind of do anything and express myself. Um, but my big fear is I would be expressing how I feel right now. And I really want this piece to encapsulate how I felt when I was 14. And I don't know. Like when I add something, I'm like, did I add that? Because that's how I felt when I was 14 or because it's how I feel now. My family wasn't accepting of me and I had no support system where I lived. So I needed a way out and I needed something to distract me from the nothing that I had in my life. So that something was art and that something was putting my feelings that my teachers, my friends, my family wouldn't hear. The canvas was that something. People get uncomfortable sometimes looking at my artwork. I think the vulnerability I'm showing kind of forces someone to reflect on their lives, uh, whatever the piece is about. And I like that it is art about me, but I'm like making someone reflect. What excites me the most is that this trans boy from Las Vegas that was stuck in a home where no one heard him actually has a voice and can speak to other trans kids. And ideally, I hope that this collection reaches those kids. If I could say something to little Victor, I would say my family's wrong. And I would say you're gonna meet amazing people in this world and you're gonna make amazing art and you can follow your dreams and you're gonna have an amazing team and you're gonna have people that support you even when you feel alone in this world and you feel like you wanna die every day don't do it life is so beautiful you just have to make it through these few years and you'll know what being happy feels like and you'll know what it's like to <laughs> hear someone say, hey Victor, and just like be so casual about it, and you'll be happy. That's what I would say. <laughs>